Alright boys, episode 4 of The Walking Dead, final season. If you guys don't remember what happened at the end of episode 3, just to refresh your mind. Long story short, we raided the ship, we raided the raiders basically, trying to get our boys back. Um, found out some crazy shit, uh, Lily's still alive, my boy James died, the ship blew up, and the episode just that kind of ended right there, so we're going to see what happens when we start episode 4. Let's get right into it boys. <clears throat> Last time on The Walking Dead. We got AJ narrating now. Since I can remember, Clem's always been there with me. She taught me to be careful, to be quiet, to be strong, to always aim for the head, to kill people that try and hurt us, to make the bad people suffer. I always listen to Clem, always, but I've been thinking more. I don't know if she's right every time. She told me to leave her if she got bit. That doesn't feel right. We're doing a lot of bad things. To save our friends. To protect our home. But when Clem told me not to shoot Lily, and she... she killed James, I got mad. So mad. I don't... I don't know what I feel anymore. I don't know if Clem knows either. But I remember all the rules. And the first one... is never go alone. I don't know, man. AJ's really losing his shit. But from what my sister told me, my sister raised AJ a lot worse, so... <laughs> I guess he's not that bad in my game. But let's see where the shit picks up. Hey, Jay. I'm slipping. Now what? We need to find a way down. This ship isn't going to stay afloat much longer. I'm kind of getting a vibe that Clem is falling apart too, You'll honestly. have to go first. You'll need a running start. Dude, she's getting sloppy. Clem, 
Oh, it's kind of my fault. I control her, I guess. Come on, you can do this, AJ. Just run and jump. You got this. I got this. I got this. AJ, what do we do when we're scared? We push through it. We don't let it take over. No, we don't. Expecting that, bro. It's too early in the episode to be died. <laughs> no, I didn't expect that, though. Nah, let me stop playing. Come on, Clint. He's a god, man. I know. See, I, alright, this episode is all over the place, boys. I didn't know I was supposed to stab him in his fucking toe. Where do you think you're going? No way to punch the other. There you go. Come on. AJ, what are you doing? Delta was the first place I called home after years of wandering. 
Good! You deserve to be alone. Maybe. To be honest, it's easier by yourself. Nothing lasts, Clementine. Not friends, not love, not the place you call home. They'll all fall eventually. Never forget that, or they'll drag you down too. Good luck out there, Lily. I hope you find peace. I'm trying to get inside her head. I'm obviously not going to hit her from that range. Everybody is like violent and shit. Can't skip this. Damn, I died twice already before the fucking credits even started. The introduction started. Like, I wonder where everybody's at. I don't want this shit to end though. Oh, I'll never skip this. Yeah, no, I can't. Sometimes I don't know where to start. Yeah, man, I don't know what to expect from this episode. Me. And it's the last episode. Like, I don't know what's gonna happen. Sometimes I don't know. This is, a lot, this is the last installment of the game so ever, too. This Telltale game shut down. Fuck. And lots of moves. And lots of rambling. Fuck. And Brad just told Clem and AJ are good. Like, I don't know what I'm asking. Bro, <laughs> there's like nothing you can hate about the girl. She gets bit, I'm gonna be so upset. I feel like some stupid shit like that's gonna happen this episode. It's about to start up though. You're still alive. You have no idea how happy I am to see you right now. Can you even talk? Get the fuck off of me! Are you okay? Yeah. My ass is a little singed, but Where's ten? I'm good. Fuck. I can't believe that works. Lou. What happened to Minnie? I don't know. I lost track after the explosion. Clem! Oh shit. Those raiders? Not our problem, we out of here, boys. Oh, thank God. You guys made it. There's ten. There's more walkers than I can count. The explosion drew them right to us. Stay cool. We knew this would happen. We just have to get off this beach. Oh, shit! Clef, do something! 
something! You! What you gonna do, woman? I almost died again. What a dumb bitch. Oh. No! Get away from her! Tons gonna come out of nowhere. About ten right now. I'll see you on the other side. <laughs> Damn right. AJ, go with him. No, I'm staying with you. <sighs> Thanks, kiddo. Renata! Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's get that out. Let's get fucking that out. Walkers in the other direction. But move it, dummy. I don't like this. We're safe, but not for long. It's so dark in here. This sucks. I'll figure something out. 
make a torch. Hmm. Perfect. Flint. I need something to burn. Before AJ can play with it. Hmm. Check his pockets. Can't burn this without something to hold it up. No way we're swimming through that. In our room. Oh, what the fuck? Have to get home I don't first. care about the collectible, man. I need to start a fire. What can I use? Damn it, it's all too wet to burn. Something to help us cross. Clem, the walkers are getting closer. Don't worry. We'll be home before you know it. Hmm, rocks are too small to walk across. But they might stop something flowing down river. I feel like I could use this branch ship. If I yank that out of there, it would drift down the river and get caught in the rocks. Could work as a bridge. Okay, we just need to go across one by one, and then we'll move the rocks out of the way. No! Ten!
weapon or nothing. No, it's a dead end. See a light down any of these tunnels. AJ, still with me? AJ, please. We have to keep moving. There's... There's nothing after this. What? James isn't in there. He looked right at me, and... and his eyes were empty. There's nothing after we die. Nothing but empty eyes. AJ, I know he was your friend, and I know this is terrible. Please don't say you're sorry. Okay. Not on you. I made the call, and Lily is the one who stabbed him. And me. It's on me, too. I... Quiet! James shouldn't have been there, AJ. None of this was supposed to happen. What? I, I can't hold all of that in my head! It's okay to be confused. You say don't be soft, but everything that you do just messes up my head! Be strong! Be brave! If something wants to hurt us, shoot it right in the head! <sighs> AJ... When we were talking with Abel, you were really cruel, letting him become a monster. Even though he told us about the boat. You didn't kill him, but it was worse than killing. AJ, please! That's enough! I'm sorry. I'm just scared something will take you away. Aren't you scared of that too? Having to leave the world behind? And me? Listen, kiddo. Everyone is scared of dying. Of what happens after. Especially if it's nothing. I don't want people I care about to leave, Clem. kill anyone that tries to take them away. I do. You told me I was right to kill Martin. But I think you were confused. By what? It was murder. And I was still right. I don't think that murder means the same thing as it did when you were little. In a world that's gone now. I think that murder now is just protecting the people around you. So part of me wants to say you're right. Maybe words do change. Well, say I'm right. I know you want to be big for everyone, but you're just a kid. Like me. Sometimes you're scared just like any other kid. So I'll help. You said I just might meet a firefighter one day. Until I do, I'm just gonna be one. Even if I don't get it just right, I am. Because all it means is killing bad people who hurt other people. And I'm good at that. Like, I think I could be the best at killing bad people. Better than you, even. Because I wouldn't hesitate. 
I think you'd be a good firefighter. I don't know. I don't know but what to say to this kid. Be so angry? This kid is really losing his mind. Melly Mel, how we doing, man? Firefighters can't be as angry as you get sometimes. I need you to trust me, Clem. That I can tell the good people and the bad people apart. That I know when to use my gun. And that you'll let me decide for my own. I don't think you're ready, AJ. You're too little. You... You don't trust me? I can't trust you to make those calls. You can't, or you won't. Can't or won't? Which one? I've raised you since you were born, AJ. And it looks like I have a long way to go. <sighs> okay. Feel that? Yeah, that's the way out. Come on. The hell? How'd they get across? I'm I a Melly Mel. This game is just giving me fucking anxiety, dog. Got Lil May losing his shit. I have a bad feeling about Flem. Tennis is just there, collecting, like, just there. Not doing nothing. This guy's just there. Watching me go through it. We got out, no way. We got out of the fucking cave. Coast is clear. If the shore is that way, then the school is probably that way. A sim was the third. Huh? The day after AJ killed Marlon, you already know Violet and I voted for you to stay. A sim was the third vote. Wait, that means Omar voted us out? And Ruby? Uh, yeah. Huh. What made you think of that? A sim said you knew how to survive. He could just tell the school would be safer with you there. I voted for you because I liked you. But his reason, it was better. I just, I just thought you should know. A sim was right. We were safer. We were more scared than we let on when you met us. That's really nice of you to say, Ten. Thank you. That's okay. Now that we're out of danger and going back home, it just made me think of it. I like a sim. If Marlon was still in charge, we'd be taken away to wherever, or dead. Instead, we fought back, because you showed us how. We weren't safe with Marlon, even in his safe zone. We were just... hiding. Who's there? The hell? Violet! Where'd she come from? You made it. You're all alive. Did everyone else escape? 
Yeah, they're okay. They took the cart and headed back to the school. We're safe, Clem. All we gotta do now is find our way home. Any idea which way that is? I know an old bridge near here. If we cross it, we won't be too far from the school. Damn, I thought it was gonna be a happy ending. I thought that was gonna be it. We found Violet, we go back to the school. That's it. Now we gotta cross some crazy ass bridge. awkward tension going on well we were looking for you guys and I I thought you might be gone for good oh uh, shit I was trying to figure out what I'd do if you were gone and I realized how goddamn stupid I was about Minnie for a whole fucking year I was so wrapped up in losing her and Sophie, I pushed away everyone who tried to care about me. Marlon, Brody, Lewis, even you and AJ, I, I, I tried my damnedest not to care about either of you. Because you were afraid of losing someone else. It's understandable. I was a goddamn coward. I'm not a coward anymore. You guys are high praise in this community. Sometimes like the the Lord and Savior. Jesus, everything's so different now. Me, us, the school. I remember how Marlon described it and what we were going to turn Erickson into. It's not the way any of us pictured it. How did you picture it? I guess I couldn't. I just listened to what Marlon said. How it would be a home, a real one, but I couldn't really wrap my head around it. My family lived in a trailer. Mm, what about you? Where'd you live? I lived in a house with my mom and dad. Fence around it, big backyard. What was your favorite part of the house? treehouse in the backyard I used to take my walkie-talkie up there and play for hours I'd pretend it was a ship and I was the pirate captain or it was an igloo and I was a hunter <laughs> or a castle and I was a princess really like with frilly dresses and a tiara yeah but also a sword a warrior princess yeah obviously the treehouse kept me alive when all this started. That's where I hid. The safe house probably you still know, be safe. Erickson can still be the home Marlin promised. As soon as we get back, we'll start rebuilding. <sighs> It'll be a lot of work, but you're right. It is worth it. Hell, we could even put in a treehouse. We've already got a bell tower. Okay, we'll build a bell tower house. Perfect. After all that's happened, it's still hard to imagine. I mean, we fought for it. Defended it. It should feel more like home than ever, but it doesn't. You know what the problem is? That stupid fucking name, Erickson. You want to rename it? <laughs> yeah. Fuck that guy. We should name it something cool. Threatening, but not like scary. You should name it. You name it. It was your idea. Go ahead, Violet. Let's see what you got. Texas. Texas. Are you We're calling it Texas? You can't just name Texas. it Texas. Are you fucking kidding me, Violet? Never letting you make a decision again. Fine. Thank you. Texas too. Te okay. Are you? Somebody get them, man. I want to help rebuild our school. You will, Ten. We all will. We can start as soon as we get back. Let's get home to Texas, too.
No, I'm not fucking with that name, dog. Okay, just take your time and keep moving forward. Alright, that's gonna be it for this part. Uh, you guys know the deal. 30 seconds later, we're gonna start recording the next part. Uh, cut the outro nice and short, so YouTube, I'll see you guys in the next part.